Welcome to this Solid Mastermind top tip for Solid Edge. Before we start, remember you can access many more of these great videos by registering for a free top tips membership over at solidmastermind.com. In this session, we'll be looking at how we can control the dimension axis when using the distance between dimension command. We'll start by looking at the more common options. We'll ensure the horizontal vertical option is set and pick these two points to see if we can indeed place either a horizontal or a vertical dimension. Changing it to by two points enables the placement of a dimension aligned between the two endpoints. However, if we wanted the dimension aligned with the upper left line, we can use the dimension axis option. To set the dimension axis, we need to hit the dimension axis button, then select the geometry we want to use, which we'll highlight in red. Then we simply need to place the dimension. The dimension axis will remain set for our current session, even if we switch between the different alignment options as shown. The dimension axis option can also be used when placing certain annotations such as centre marks. Here we want to place centre marks on these four holes, but we want them aligned to the legs. As such, we can set the edge of one of the legs as the dimension axis to achieve our desired result. If you liked this video, please comment on it using the space below. And remember, to access many more of these great Solid Edge videos, please register for a free Top Tips membership over at solidmastermind.com.